Hi everybody and welcome to the Armpit Fudge video with me, Lena. Um, you may know also, I'm on the PTFA, but I'm also um, a guider in this area and uh, I volunteer with the 4th Clean Brownies. Our main thing is, if you're interested in guiding, this is the kind of stuff we get up to. Okay, so let me get on it. Right, what you'll need for Armpit Fudge, if you haven't got it already, is 50 grams of icing sugar. Nice. Uh, one tablespoon of butter. Two teaspoons of cream cheese. Oh, you lost my cream cheese then. And two teaspoons of cocoa. Mmm, a little bit of chocolate. And um, some, literally, a little dash of vanilla essence as well. Obviously, the really important thing is a bag. Ziploc, preferably. If you haven't got one, get something where you can seal it in shut, okay? So it's not going to go everywhere. As much as you think this is going to be messy, it's actually not going to be that messy, okay? So, and also what I've got is some additional little sprinkles to put on the end of it. So if you do have any of those in the cupboard, or if you've got a bit of chocolate that you've got in there, definitely put that in. So take your bag, okay? Fold it over. So you, can you see, so I've got a little bit of seal there. It just means that I haven't got to scoop it in too far into the bag, okay? And what I'm going to do, so I'm going to just throw all the ingredients in. So I'm going to start off with my ice and sugar because it's my biggest ingredient. Now you get that nice little bit of a <coughs> powder smoke on that one. Okay, so make sure you've got it all in there. And then I'm going to start taking my cocoa powder. I'm going to pour in there as well. Lovely. I'm going to take my cream cheese and butter and I'm going to scuff it in. Oh, nice sticky butter. You can use the bag to get it off the spoon if you're struggling like I am. Cream cheese again. Love a bit of cream cheese, love a bit of good cheese. See all this stuff you would eat without it being in the bag anyway. Then, literally a dash, okay? Because you'd be surprised. It's a powerful little bottle, this one. Okay, so there you go. So now, what you want to do, do a little like that. You want to fold it all the way back up so it goes back to being a normal Ziploc bag, okay? And what you want to do is start from the bottom and you want to push the air out. You do not want any air in this bag. Okay, so make sure it goes all the way up to the top. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna seal it. Okay, so this could be with your clip or it could be with the actual zip lock itself. So still give it a good go, make sure there's no air in it. See, I've got a bit of air in the top there. So I'm squeezing all that out, making sure there's no big holes because this could be getting really interesting. Now, you may be asking me right now, why is it called armpit fudge? Well, because you don't mix it in the normal sense. You stick it under your armpit and you give it a good whack. So you've got to really keep it going, get it squished up there. You can see it all mixing together nicely, so keep it going. You might need to move the bag around a bit. That's it. Oh dear. You might have a bit of an upset daisy with what we are having. I hope your bag is a bit more zip not than mine is. Hey, you can't beat a bit of laughter when it comes to all this, okay? So keep going, keep going. Don't worry, because uh, brownies was yesterday, so I haven't got to worry about that. <laughs> okay. Keep going. Told you, this is live, guys. This is live. We're not doing this stuff by me. So what you should get is it starts to mix up a bit. So if you need to do a little bit of your hands, if not, kids, you're probably a lot better than me, and you can still give it a good mix, okay? At the end, you will get, as you can see, like, you see how it's all coming together? And what you should get is a really nice consistency. So if you're not already covered in ice sugar, and I really hope it hasn't happened to you, try and give it a bit more of a whack with your armpit. What do you think with your armpit is it doing? Okay, it's a lot of heat under your armpit. Okay, every, every when you're out in a cold, and you think, oh, it's freezing. You put your hands under your armpit because it's nice and warm. That's what's happening to your ingredients. They're all mixing up nicely. Oh, look at that gooey goodness. Anybody else got a nice and sugar armpit? <laughs> no. Please let me in your comments if that happened to you as well, because it's all a bit of a laugh, isn't it? Oh! <laughs> it is so much fun. Right, let's try and do a bit more of that. A bit more of that. Okay, so I'm going to take this now. As you can see, it is proper. Just an ooey gooey goodness of mess, okay? If you still feel like it needs a little bit more, you keep going. But I've only got one uniform, and we don't want to literally be covered, okay? So I'm going to take it out. Look at that. I know you're probably thinking, oh, what's it? But it does taste yummy, okay? So fold it down as you did before, okay? And you literally, what you could do, if you'd been really prepared like, like me and bought some scissors, which I didn't, but you can, just cut the corner off and you can squeeze it out that way. Or if you're like me and you might try and repurpose this bag after and use it for something else, which in my case not, because it's got a hole in it already. <laughs> so I will scoop it out and... Uh, getting out there see mine needs a bit more of the uh, the powder mixing see it's how see how it's all getting gloopy like that 
So you can make this, this is only a small batch, so if you want extra, double your batch up, okay? And so if I stick it in here now, I've got my gloopy dessert. This is a really good topping for a dessert. It's a really good dessert on its own. I mean, if you're feeling that messy, guys, just eat it out the bag. But I don't recommend that, kids. Please make sure your parents are very aware that what you're doing in there. So obviously, I have just about done enough to get it out there because my bag is kind of split, which is not what we wanted to do. But what I would normally do now is I'd wax some sprinkles on the top of that and finish off scooping out. You don't want a 15 minute video of watching me scoop out the rest of this. You kind of get the idea, okay? So, I really hope you enjoy your yummy dessert because that's what it is, kids, it's dessert. So have your tea and this goes after your tea because I don't want no parents moaning at me that you were bouncing around all evening, okay? So maybe you can just bounce around later on to Mr. Davis's disco. Okay, so I've got a bit more in there and see. Oh, that's good. That's some good stuff. Extra sprinkles on it too. I really hope I haven't got loads of chocolate. When I said you might not get that much messy. <laughs> Let's be honest, I got a little bit messy. But it's all about having fun. Enjoy your time and your family, guys. Okay, don't forget to post your videos on Flipgrid. Have fun.